All right, let's figure out this bow tie business. Okay, so you're gonna start off like you're tying your shoelaces left over right. The bunny goes through the hole or whatever your mother told you when you were tying your shoelaces anyway. Alrighty, so get it kind of tight, flip the top half over very fabulously, and then you're gonna bring the bottom half up as shown. I don't know how to describe it, but just do that. All right, <laughs> fold the bottom hamburger style. There's gonna be a hole back there. You're going to feed the bottom half through the hole. Don't push it all the way through, just kind of very gently so you can get your bow shape there. Trust me from experience, if you push it all the way through, then you gotta start over. Okay, so now um, it doesn't look like you have, but you have in fact tied a bow tie. You're going to have to form the bow a little, as you see me doing here, because I didn't think I did it, but this take, I actually got it. It took me about 10 times, but I got it. Okay, so there you are, guys. You have tied a bow tie. Hopefully, if you're doing it with me, then you have tied a bow tie, okay? Um, and it's actually definitely not as hard as I have made it seem. It's fairly easy once you get the hang of it. So um, one thing I want to share with you, make sure you adjust the tie for your neck size. It makes a huge difference. Your bow is not super huge and it just it makes it a lot better. Okay, so major shout out to Gerard Blanding for letting me use his bow tie. It was brought back in good condition, although I kind of wanted to rip it in half while I was working on it. I was that frustrated. Also, so I don't get sued, this music is Go Kart by Kevin McLaurin. Alrighty guys, go try it out. It's pretty cool. Bye.